Hey guys, so just want to talk you through Google Ads. Do they work? How to set them up effectively? How I'm finding them working? And so on and so forth. Now I don't want to show you my exact URLs because this video may get into the wrong hands. But in the month of November, across a number of different websites, I spent 43.3k on AdWords, generating 30,000 clicks, 1 million impressions, and it performs relatively well. A wee story um, that is quite interesting for people. Now, obviously, a guy like myself, 20 years or 22 years in the SEO space, um, is always going to say SEO is the best, blah, 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 blah. But I've changed that uh, approach over the years. Um, I don't want to solely rely on organic search. I don't want to wake up when Google have done an update and find that 40% of my traffic's down, which is 40% of my revenue. Um, so it's, you know, something I've always tried to play around with is, is AdWords and, and various other paid sources of traffic. Earlier this year, I bought a business that had went bankrupt. Um, now, the business was well established. Uh, in 20 years of history, it was in a great little niche which is relatively untapped and the person who previously owned it just didn't understand the online game, online marketing and were hemorrhaging money. Um, so I had a look at it and thought, this is something I can do. In 2023, I have generated 1.561 million pounds worth of revenue. Now, you'll be able to see on a daily basis, I can get five, six grand, whatever it might be, um, sometimes seven, eight grand. Now, that is all good and well. <laughs> I am doing paid ads on this. Now, both Facebook, and I will go into paid social media in another section, and Google AdWords. So in this niche, there's a massive ROI on paid ads. That's one of my campaigns there. I want to spend a thousand pounds a day on Google AdWords, and I try my best to do that using different campaigns. Now, on a regular basis, I'm spending six, seven hundred pounds, whatever it may add up to. Um, it's working well, 450 clicks, I'm getting 61 conversions, everything's going well. The website's a pile of shit, first and foremost. It's uh, built on Ruby and the Rails, I think it was built 15 years ago or so. Um, so trying to do SEO on it and stuff like that, you know, I, I've not got to that level yet. Something I'm considering going into 2024. Uh, but I'm not buying an asset and not doing any work on it just now. So I've been able to grow and scale it using paid ads. And as long as there's that return on investment, you don't need to just rely on organic search. Now, my total revenue for October on that particular website was 148000 my total spend on AdWords for that website was 18 grand. So you can see, of course, it's a drop shipping business. I'm not walking away with 148 grand in my back pocket. Of course, I've got 18 grand to pay for Google AdWords. Of course, I've got the product to pay for. Now, more than 100 grand, just over 100 grand of that is all the accumulated costs. But I'm still walking away with 40 odd grand worth of profit. Um, so taking a business from literally zero to that, uh, just using paid ads, you can do the math. Websites sell for between 35 and 50 times their monthly profit. Um, so you can see there, I've got an asset that is worth a lot of money and I've used paid ads to do that. And obviously I do this to diversify my income streams. So throughout this section, I'm going to show you how I've set up my ads. I'm not going to show you the live ad campaign just for obvious reasons. I'm sure you'll understand as much as I'd love to share with 
99% of you as long as that one person. Um, anyway, I'm going to show you what I do, how I set it up. If you've never done an ad campaign, then I'll, I'll go through the basics as well. So that is all in this section. Hopefully you enjoy it. Thank you.